Jurassic World, super entertaining, but also totally full of mistakes. Here's the things you need to know if you would like to watch Jurassic World with full-on scientific superiority. So not realistic. Between Jurassic Park and Jurassic World, 20 years have elapsed and in that time, paleontologists have discovered a whole lot of new dinosaurs, but did any of them appear in the movie? No. That's not a mosquito, that's a crane fly. Speaking of mosquitoes, the whole premise of this movie is that they got the DNA for the dinosaurs from fossilized mosquitoes. But how did mosquitoes manage to bite these sea creatures that lived their whole lives underwater? Some dinosaurs have feathers, but not in Jurassic World. That would be visually inconsistent. Pterosaurs have bones like tissue paper. They would not be strong enough to lift a human. You could actually crush one if you really wanted to. This guy actually has the feet correct. Well done. As you can see from this highly accurate scientific model, most dinosaurs have flat feet, but in the movie, most dinosaurs have raptor feet like an eagle. Wrong. Most dinosaurs eat with their mouths, not like modern raptors do, where they like rip food from their claws. Jurassic World ruined T-Rex for everyone. T-Rex's hands go not like this, but like this. T-Rex is a clapper, not a slapper. Jurassic World had no paleontologist in it. It had geneticists, it had a velociraptor trainer, but no actual paleontologist, probably why the whole thing went awry. Chris Pratt should have been shirtless more, but also he's a velociraptor trainer. And like crocodiles, velociraptors would not have been domesticated and therefore would have been untrainable. I'm sorry, Chris Pratt, I know you have many talents, but velociraptor training would not be one of them. Mesosaur, also not a dinosaur, not even from the Jurassic period, Get it out. Curse your sudden but inevitable betrayal. And I'm not even gonna talk about the fact that the DNA would have already degraded by now. So the whole premise of Jurassic World is flawed. So this weekend, if you're going to a movie because you wanna see a hot man, then try Jurassic World. But if you wanna go and see a movie that's accurate, Jurassic World is not for you. Hi everyone, I'm Jade Lovell, resident science nerd on the Young Turks Network. You're watching SciQ and we know you don't want to miss an episode, so please click the subscribe button down below.